Yo, this is for the children, and the children's children, and the children's children's children, and their children too. Got this thing going down in Standing Rock. They try to build a pipeline, but it got blocked by the prayers of some people who really care a lot about the air and the water, and they ain't gonna stop. We've had some good successes, and we've made a lot of progress, but we're gonna need your help if we're really gonna stop this. Tell them they can wreck our climate and our water for their profits. Help us make us sound so loud, Obama hears it in his office. And we do it peacefully. We do it peacefully. Cause that's the only way that we gon' fulfill the prophecy We do it lovingly, and do it prayerfully Cause the elders say that this is how we gon' fulfill the prophecy But how can I help? Yo, I'm really glad you asked October 8th through 11th, we're going to pray and dance Close some bank accounts and boycott all the gas And find creative ways to make a positive impact Yeah, we got a lot of people and the movement's gaining traction But we got a bigger dream, and we're trying to make Make it happen. 5,000 prayers and 5,000 actions in the span of four days popping off across the atlas. And we do it peacefully. We do it peacefully because this is how we maintain our integrity. Yeah, we do it prayerfully and we do it lovingly because keeping our compassion is the most important victory. We're not standing up to a pipeline. We're standing up to a paradigm that values money over life. So for everyone's sake, this October 8th, 9th, 10th, and 11th, one day for each of the four sacred directions, let's pray hard and be proactive. Whether it's a vigil, or a ceremony, or a letter writing party, or a gas boycott, let's make an impact in a good way where it really counts. And when you make your prayers, consider praying for the pipeline workers. Consider praying for the bankers. Consider praying for the people who brought the dogs out because they are our brothers and sisters too and they need clean water and they need a stable climate and they need a prayer just like we do.